What do you mean they're being reduced? Where, where are they, how are they being reduced? And if so, where is the money going? So uh, the U.S. has for a long time been the most stable country around the world to invest in. But now that image of stability seems to be weakening politically, legally, monetarily, and, and even culturally. Um, as you know, politics is driven by more and more by the two extremes. Legal troubles are mounting for both presidents. Lady Justice has lost her blindfold. The ballooning debt service and deficit spending, if projected out by a decade, seems to be spiraling out of control. Is, uh, Tomas, few, is, is this more your belief, or is this actually backed up by the data? Well, it is, it is my belief, and it is to some extent backed back up by the data. Yes, that's what prompted me to believe this. Yes. So what is so, the data telling us? Uh, the data is telling us that the, the, the markets are, are, uh, not, uh, are going up less than they used to. And uh, more and more money is, is coming out of uh, some of the larger accounts, and uh, some of it is going into other markets. And what does that mean for your overall view of uh, the equity markets in the U.S.? I think that until we get our house in order, the, the, the large investors must uh, consider how to reallocate their investments. And uh, this may continue up until valuations either become very low or some stabilizing news comes. Uh, yeah, come to dominate the the news cycle, right? There is no no doubt we have our share of issues that, that thankfully we won't debate here. But you know, most of the allocations that I hear about are not out of the equity market to another equity market, but into fixed income, given the rates that we're seeing available for the first time in really a generation. Uh, yeah, are you seeing that, that as well? Yeah. Yes, but that, and, and you know they, they they go the allocations go into the very very large multinational tech companies that appear to be uh, somewhat safer than the U.S. government, right? So yes, yeah. that's, that that is also the explanation for the Magnificent Seven, right? Yeah. So are you one of those who shares a concern overall in the long term for the ability oh, of the U.S. Oh. government to pay down, to pay its debts, to pay its interest on its debt? Well, no, it will be able to pay the interest, but it will be able to pay the interest with less and less valuable dollars, right? So and eventually that is going to become un unsustainable. Right. Right. Well, yeah, we can print them, but that's not necessarily a good thing. Tomas, always good to get your uh, sense of things. Appreciate it. Thank you.